Hello. In this tutorial, I'll show you how to get PFX in GoDaddy. So the first thing I'd like you to do is to launch your GoDaddy web account, which of course is this right here. So the next thing is I'm going to show you how to get an account on GoDaddy. Launch in the browser of your choice. And then from your browser, check the top corner. We're going to find the search bar. In the search bar, type GoDaddy.com and it's going to take you to the official website for GoDaddy. Now from the website, check the top right corner, you're going to find the sign up option, click sign up and it's going to take you through a process for creating an account. The process is quite self-explanatory. Now you'll be either asked to create an account manually or automatically using Facebook, Google or Apple. Whichever option you find suitable, go ahead and create your account and once you're done creating your account, it's going to take you to the GoDaddy official homepage. This is not the home page. Once you get to the home page, check the top right corner of that home page. You're going to find your profile name. Click on your profile name and you're going to see an extended menu. Now from the menu, click my products. Once you click on my products, it's going to take you to this fantastic page, which is the my products page. Now from this page, let's learn how we can get PFX in GoDaddy. And there's something I'd like you to know. That you cannot get pfx without buying your ssl certificate so ssl certificate is something that it's a product that you buy on godaddy now once you have purchased that from this my products page if you scroll all the way down you're going to see ssl certificates of course after you have purchased it so under the ssl certificate you're going to select the certificate that you want to download all right so go ahead and find the ssl certificate you want to download and then just right the side of the certificate, you're going to find manage. Just so you can find manage all right here, you're going to see manage. Go ahead and click manage. And once you click on manage, it's going to open you up to another page. All you need to do is to click on download. You're going to see the download button. So click on the download button. And then once you download, once you click on the download button, you're going to see an option for you to download it as a PFX file. So click on the download button to download the PFX file. And once you do that, you will definitely get your SSL certificates as the PFX file. Now you can head over to your file, your system file, to find the file because it will definitely be easy for you to find. And you'll be good to go. So you can go over the tutorial from top to bottom to get acquainted with the steps. And once you're done, you'll be good to go. I hope this video helped you search.